Hi ladies, it's your girl Angel. This is going to be a quick video, just kind of updating you guys on what I'm doing to kind of get in shape for TTC, as well as getting ready for my trip down to Daytona for my birthday um, with me and my husband. I have been walking every day. Uh, I've been jogging a couple days out of the week as well. Um, I didn't jog yesterday or the day before. The day before there was a um, smoke storm. Or not storm, but I don't know. There was a wildfire, wildfire outside of Wilmington, and so all the smoke was blowing into like Kerry and Raleigh. So it was like a level orange um, air condition, uh, air levels outside. So I didn't want to chance me jogging and then inhaling all that smoke. So I just did two laps around the block with the puppies. Um, yesterday, I actually went walking with my neighbor. She's also trying to get in shape, so we've decided to get up every morning and go walking. She takes her baby with her in the stroller, so um, not much room for running there. Yesterday, I did um, I did two laps, um, one with Brownie and then one with Blase, which there's Blase. First, just sitting there. Brownie's under the bed, like, with her ball, so she's waiting for him to come out so she can attack him. But um, I did a block with her and then a block with Brownie. And then I came home and um, took a shower and cleaned up a little bit, cooked. And then later on that evening, about, I say, 6 o'clock, me and her went walking again. We did about another 14 blocks. Um, we just kept walking and walking and walking and pretty much walked all the way around Cary. Um, so that was actually really nice. Um, so total 16 blocks yesterday. Um, we did do a power walk, so very good ex exercise. Also, I made my husband yesterday get um, my chair out of storage. So this is my ab lounge too. Um, I hate getting on the floor during crutches, and I really just want to tone up my stomach. So this is really going to help um, me do that. So, I'm going to be walking in the morning and then actually sitting in the chair. I'm about to actually go walking now. Well, I'm going to run um, today. Me and the puppies are going to run this morning and then me and my neighbor are going to walk later on this evening. So, I don't know if I'm going to do, I guess, like, progression shots or whatever on a week to week basis. But I will show you guys kind of me starting and then where I'm going to end up. At the first place I started to lose weight is in my face. As you guys can see, my cheeks are really fluffy and I've got a slight little second chinny. <laughs> Not proud of, but I'm going to get rid of it. Um, but here's a, I guess a mirror view. Sorry if there's a glare, but you really can't see. Um, I do have a little pooch that I want to get rid of. Um, we are going down to Daytona and I am determined that I am going to be in a two-piece, you guys. Yes, I said it. I am going to be in a bikini, tea. so uh, the stomach has to go. That's not sexy in a bikini. Um, also, I want to work on tightening up my arms. As you guys can see, they're a little flabby. So I'll start doing some thumbnails as well. Um, here's kind of a, a side view um, of the pooch down here. <laughs> um, yeah, so hoping that it's all flatten out and everything will be good. Um, my boobs and my butt, I've had these guys. And as you see, ah, you too. Here are the puppies. These are what are keeping me active as well. Look, there's little brownie. Yeah, you caught on camera, being bad. But I've had my boobs and my butt since I was about 13. Um, I'm a double D. There's no getting around that. So basically, it's just going to be toning up my stomach and my arms, and slimming down my thighs. Um, I doubt if my butt goes anywhere, so I'm kind of stuck with it. But my husband likes it. He likes the double D's, so it'll be okay. Um, but that's just kind of my weight loss routine or what I'm doing to get in shape. Um, it's more so for Daytona. Um, I know me slimming down a little bit or at least getting a little bit more fit and active will help with us TTCing as well. Um, I don't want anyone to say, well, you're overweight. That's why you're not getting pregnant. Me and my husband know the deal. It's his low sperm count, so I don't want to hear about obesity being a part of that um yeah currently my doctor tells me I'm obese <laughs> for my height but yeah but anyway I think that's pretty much it ladies I'll talk to you guys later bye